Welcome back you guys. Today we got the Armor All Extreme Shield Ceramic Tire Coating. Everybody likes a long lasting coating on their tires or everything ceramic. We're going to put it up against what we used last week, the Meguiar's NXT Insane Shine. Last week we had it on these tires. I left it on here for a week. This is what it looks like. Picked up, a little bit of fuzziness. It did, you can see, it lasted a week, but it kind of went into a matte finish. But it was insane, insane shine, so I'm gonna take my time, clean this all off. I'm gonna let you guys see it before we apply these two, but I'm gonna tape this off, and let's do the showdown, okay? So let's get this tire cleaned up. Okay, it's dry on the surface that we need to use it on. It's been thoroughly cleaned. I'm not sure about in these cracks. It's cleaned pretty good. Look at that normal dry tire it's probably got some product residue in it i'm not sure but let's tape it off and get this started okay we're gonna get started with the armor off first just so you guys know i dropped the can earlier and that's why it's been like this but let's go ahead and do it on this side it sprays nicely so let's just dab it in wipe off the overspray i don't know it kind of went into it really good so let's just leave it there wipe off all the excess over here I like the way that sprayed you're not supposed to do this out in direct sun it's kinda cool out here so not a big deal alright let me get that a little more even on this side okay that looks pretty good let's give that about 15 minutes to dry let's just go ahead and start the other side Make sure you guys shake these. I shook the other can. I do not like the way this stuff sprays. Look at, in order to get your tire, you have to hold it like, what, is it, what am I, two and a half feet back? And then it's still wild, spraying everything. So with a different rag, I just try to get the overspray first. Yeah. Like I said before, you're gonna need an applicator with this. Maguire stuff. Look at how thick that is. It's just big, thick. And it feels thick. Okay. Look at on this side. Now we're getting a little bit of a run. So, with my other rag, let's kind of clean that up. So that way it dries even. Okay. Alright, let's give this about 15 minutes to dry. And then I'll pull the tape. You guys, it's taking forever to dry with the sun on this stuff. Remember that? I had to pull it inside. So it's still wet, a little bit wet in some areas. We're going to give it another 15 minutes. All right, we're back, and I think everything's pretty dry. This is the side with the armor all. I like the way it looks. It's not too shiny, and it's not supposed to be. If you guys look here, this is actually medium shine. All right, it says down on the bottom. So we're not comparing the same exact thing. What is this saying? insane shine so medium versus insane just so you guys can get the comparison so you guys know but I'm about to pull the tape all right so it kind of bled through on this side I'm not sure if I should spread tire stuff out a few more weeks to let it let the old product wear off completely but we're gonna have to see you know We'll give this some time. I like the way it looks. And then this side, the insane shine, it's still, it looks a little bit wet still. Is it? It's not. I don't think it is. It's a little bit wet. I'm gonna go pull it out in the sun. Let's look at it out there. So remember, the side with the nozzle is the Meguiar's. Okay. This side out here, we could see the Meguiar's is still insanely shiny, as you can see. And then this was the tape that was on the bottom. The other product, the Armorall, it's matte. It's supposed to last a really long time. It looks good. It honestly looks good. It's not overly wet like this stuff. It is very subtle. It blends more into the back, because if you notice with this stuff, it's kind of a big problem right there. I mean, I don't know if you're not supposed to coat this whole side, so 
it might look a little bit tacky to some people. You might want to go with just, you know, more of a matte or not as shiny of a finish, which is right here. And it blends with the rest of the tire pretty good. So it might just be personal preference. We'll give it some time, about a week or so, hopefully. You know, remember to come back and we'll, we'll check this out. So this lasted a pretty good week. We'll see how this lasts. Appreciate you guys for watching. See you guys next video. Don't forget, hit the like button and hit the subscribe. Thanks for watching.